Welcome to Caravan of the Year 2023, sponsored by MSA 4x4 Accessories. Now I'm inside the 575 Titan from Titan Caravans. Now at only 5.7 meters long, it's incredibly spacious. Now we're in the Yarra Valley for four days of testing this year, so let's hear from the four judges. The Titan that we reviewed is a smaller uh, family van, 18 foot six. Uh, it had an east-west queen size bed, three bunks down the back, and a very workable kitchen area, a combination shower and toilet. The thing I liked about the kitchen was it was designed on a bit of an angle, which allowed for a bigger combination shower and toilet, which is important for a family. It has a compressor fridge, a top loader washing machine. So it's got all the comforts that you need when you're traveling with your family. Titan have come a long way in the last couple of years and their dedication to getting off-road is demonstrated by the fact that they've now switched to Alco suspension for all their vans. It's an 18 foot six van with uh, twin axles, so it's got plenty of payload. There's heaps of solar and battery power, plenty of water. So for a family of three kids and a couple of adults, you should be able to spend a fair bit of time in the bush. Titan caravans have a bit of a speciality in the area of self-sufficiency. Titan's electrical capacity is really good. They have about 400 amperes of lithium batteries, 400 watts of solar capacity, and 3,000 watt inverter. They use a Victron system, and on top of that, just for in the water department, they have 395 litre tanks of fresh water and 65 litres of grey. That's not bad for a family van that's uh, going to do a bit of off road work. For me, the X factor in the 575 Hybrid Titan has to be its build methodology. Now, they use a full composite body. It's a sandwich pressed foam core, an XPS foam, with fiberglass skins on both sides. And what's relatively unique about it is that it's a baked wall and roof system. By baking it, it means it's going to reduce the risk of any delamination in those panels. And of course, it's backed up with a decent warranty as well. For me, I also find the battery system a bit of an X factor. We do see a lot of power in vans these days. We do see a lot of solar on vans, but the Victron system the guys are using, it's a really good system in terms of being able to pick individual components and put them where you want them in the van. It's very user-friendly as well, which I really like. On the quality front, all the Titan vans are built in China. The way they do that is they build the bodies over there, uh, much of the structural work, but the rest of the fit out is done here. All the components are fitted here and that's so they can maintain some control over their work. This year we towed the Titan Blackhawk 575 hybrid van and it's a hybrid because it's as livable outside as it is inside. It's a small van, it's 18 foot 6, it's not a large van and it has a tear of about 2,660 kilos so it's not a big van. Uh, we took it on a tow test uh, behind a V8 Nissan Patrol. It handled beautifully, there was no sway from the van, no bounce from the van, a very easy van to tow. And the great thing about this Titan is, because it's a smaller van, you don't need a huge vehicle to tow it. I think the innovation in this van is the fact that they've got this 18 foot 6 size, this small twin axle caravan, relatively lightweight, being able to fit all the amenities for a family of five into a van of this size is, is really important. It's a full composite van, really well constructed chassis, and so we shouldn't forget that, even though it's been around a while. It, its construction process is really state of the art still. We should also point out that Titan have gone with the Victron system. It's a very capable, very reliable, and, and very rugged system for them. I have a great deal of confidence in it. It's an 18 foot 6 van and it's $105,000. Now a lot of people are going to balk at that price, but we live in a new world, prices have gone up dramatically. I actually see it as good value for money, especially when you start breaking down what comes with it with a stage 2 electronics upgrade. You get a lot of lithium, a lot of solar, a decent amount of water. I think it's good value. On the customer care front, Titan offer a 3 year warranty on their fit out, 5 years on their chassis and 10 years on their heat laminated walls, roof and flooring. That includes water and dust ingress. They also have a hotline which is manned 24 hours. In addition to that, one of the requirements of the Titan warranty is you get your van serviced every 10,000 kilometres. I really enjoyed my time with the 575 Titan. 18.6 is a great size. It's small enough to tow with most cars and being twin axle, it's okay to manoeuvre. A little bit more difficult than a single, 
but the benefit of that twin axle is that bigger payload. 